Hi guys, today I'm just going to answer a question regarding this book here called Perfect Pick Technique by Iva Merentz. The question asked relates to page 19 of this book. When you actually alternate picking, your hand is moving along this line. This is what's happening. It's not going straight up like that or coming back like this. It's going along this line. When you understand this, it's very easy to play scales and arpeggios and things because you can just follow this line. And remember to come up on your upstroke, because it's more than likely going to be up, skip over, pluck down, or down, skip over, pluck up. Okay, as you can see, this is the line. So to pluck the strings, you can see that the hand will be in this position for the first string. For the second string, third string, fourth string, fifth string, sixth string. That way there's no bending and twisting and, you know, silliness. It's just very, very simple. This is where the pick will be as it's moving across the strings. It won't be moving up like this or moving back like this. It's just that way you're aligned with every string that you pluck. There's no tension, there's no anything because you're just going forward, coming back. It's just like strumming. You don't strum like this. You strum like this. It's just exactly the same thing. It's very, 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 very simple. Most people have difficulty when crossing the strings. So for instance, it will either be down, you skip over to pluck up to the next string. Or up, skip over, pluck down. doing these exercises I'm just floating along this line. I'm not pivoting like this. I'm just floating. Anyway, if this video was of any use to you, then please smash the subscribe button, smash the like button, click the notification button, write a comment in the comment section, and I'll see you all in the next video. And thank you very much for watching.